Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I just did my hair, but I'm gonna do my makeup and film it. Talk about different things, so let's get into it. I am like really awkward sometimes when like I haven't, I can't even tell you the last time that I filmed something. And I go to film like vlogs or videos all the time and then just don't post them because I'm like so insecure that they're just like stupid or no one's gonna watch them, which is probably what this is too, but whatever. First, I'm gonna start off using my Benefit Professional Primer. If you hear, that is my cat Max. You wanna see him? It's been so long now, Sinus. Say hi. Say hello. Hello. Say hi. He doesn't give a rat's butt. Well, I've had that primer for like quite a while now, but I really didn't like use it that often. But I've been using it recently and more so like as of lately because when I do like setting powder under my eyes like it would get like you could see like fine lines but when I use primer I find that it doesn't do that and it doesn't like you can't see like lines because like I'm tired most of the time so you know I am still on my it cosmetics CC cream so I will just squeeze a pump of that in my palm grab a brush and just start putting that on my face. I hope everyone had a good Christmas. We went to PEI for Christmas, which was really nice because I haven't spent Christmas with my mom in a while. So that was really nice because my mom was in school and I was in school. So we saw each other at the end of September at my cousin's wedding and we literally hadn't seen each other since then. So from end of September to Christmas Eve, we hadn't seen each other and it was so sad. Now I'm going to use my Too Faced Born This Way concealer. And I have been so fortunate to have some pimples lately. So I cover those up and I literally went to Sephora when it was summertime and the girl picked the lightest shade for me and said that it was my shade and it's snow. Look how light that is. So I haven't gotten a new one since because, you know, poor student props can't go to Sephora whenever you want and buy makeup. So just work with what you got. I have bronzer, so just normally bronze my face up quite a bit, but I had to add some extra light in here because sometimes when I do my makeup in my bathroom, like we just have one small overhead light and I do my makeup in here because all my stuff is in here and so I would do my makeup and then I'd go like out somewhere and I noticed like in the mirror that my face was like orange. So I added some more light so hopefully I won't look like I rolled in Cheetos today when I go out. So blend that out. I like to wet my beauty blender but then also like when I'm using it I spray it with my, whoops I didn't even get my beauty blender. And my favorite all-time setting spray is Urban Decay All Nighter. I mean, is there really any other setting sprays? Like, I've used um, the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water, and I will use that. I didn't use it today, but I'll use it like after I put on my moisturizer. I'll just like spray my face, just kind of freshen it up before I put some makeup on. I'm now gonna use my Laura Mercier translucent powder. The stuff is thebalm.com. Um, New Year's resolutions. I don't really do them because I don't tend to 
stick to them at all. I find it more helpful to do like a weekly resolution rather than a yearly one. But my boyfriend Brandon has been doing really good with his like New Year's resolution, so proud of him for doing that. But me, I've just always, like I always strive to be healthy and like work out and like do better for my body, so. Oh, that pimple's so dark. Okay, I gotta fix this, one sec. I'm not really a big powder fan, but ever since I've been using my primer, the Benefit one, and putting it, like I said, like under my eyes and everything, I find this stays so much better and goes on so much nicer. So now I'm gonna do my brows. I use the Goof Proof. <laughs> I use the Goof Proof Brow Pencil by Benefit in the shade three. So I'm gonna fill in my brows. Okay, so I colored in my brows and then I just set them with this NYX Tinted Brow Mascara. So I do that just to make sure that they stay in place throughout the day, but I don't find it really works that good. The horrible thing about when you go into Sephora and buy all these high-end makeup products and then you just want them all because nothing else compares. So, I'm gonna be taking my Benefit Hula Bronzer and just putting it in my crease. This is like my favorite thing to do. I'm not good at eyeshadow, I'm not good at makeup at all. Like, I wish I was, I wish I had like a good friend that was awesome at makeup and could teach me their magical ways. I should probably watch like videos and stuff, but even then I probably wouldn't be able to really do it, so. So for New Year's resolutions, basically I'm just trying to eat healthier, exercise every day, <coughs> voice crack, um, and I don't normally like exercise every day, especially if we have like a lot going on that day, but I'm trying to like exercise more because I just feel so much better when I exercise, so why not? And it's like a, the endorphins, when you exercise are good for you and all that jazz. I'm good at makeup so I don't splurge, I almost dropped that, on eyeshadow palettes, but I just have this Rimmel London Spicy Edition, Spice Edition palette, so. I'm going to be using that. So I'm just using like the, the lightest shade here. I'm just putting that here. If any of you are watching this and you're good at makeup and you're like cringing, I'm so sorry. I'm just not good at makeup. I really wish I was, but I'm just not, so. Oh, I should probably be showing you. So, I just use, I'm using this and this, just to kind of darken it up right here. I don't think I'm gonna use any more, well, one second. So I have had the Tartlet Tees little palette for over a year and it's still like like I said I'm not I'm not good at makeup and you know. So I'm gonna use actually some colors in this. So I'm using the one first kiss just to kinda that's not even sparkly. See, I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay. Mm. Alright. So I'm using a flat like whatever this brush is, and I'm just going to use some of my Becca Opal highlighter, and 
it broke, so that was really sad. But the actual thing didn't broke, so break. Oh my gosh, I need to go back to school. I don't go back to school till January 22nd, and it's been nice having a long break, but at the same time I am like ready to go back to school. I'm excited, I'm refreshed, I'm rejuvenated, I'm ready, so. And I'll put some of that on my lid too. See, I use like highlighter and bronzer, so I don't really know what I'm doing, like ever, but it's fun. It's okay. Just wing it. That's what I do. Alright, so it's kind of getting like loose. fell in love with this mascara that is actually in my purse so I'll be right back so I got my mascara I'm just gonna set my face with the uh, sand and spray fan that a bit now I have to curl my eyelashes So I've been using the CoverGirl Clump Crusher and I honestly love it. It's so nice to build on and I think it looks so good. I used to use the L'Oreal Lash Paradise, the voluminous one, which is like a dupe or dupe, um, I don't know how to say that word, for the Tarte or Face better than sex mascara but this one like it doesn't like clump on the brush or anything so I'm gonna do this in the mirror so I've used the orange one and the purple one of this and I never discovered this one until recently and is honestly my favorite right now so I'm gonna do another layer of this I normally do like a couple layers of mascara and I normally don't like to put it on my bottom lashes, but I have been recently. Just to try something new. So I'm just gonna spray my beauty blender and blend some of my face. Just to make sure there's no like excess powder that's gonna like rub off and just set everything in place again. And my hands are really dirty, so I'm gonna use a wipe and wipe all that makeup off. So I hope everyone had a great Christmas and that this video was semi interesting to watch. Oh. I had a straggler that I had to use a bobby pin. Oh my gosh, I have something in my eye. One sec. Oh. I do not like when stuff gets in my eyes. Just fluffing up my hair a bit and spreading my curls with my fingers. And I think I'll do a final spray. I use the Got To Be Volumanic Bodifying Hairspray. I use a lot of Got To Be Herbal Essence and Not Your Mother's. Those are like the main hair companies that I tend to buy. Just because I like the smell and I find it works good. So. 
I don't like my hair to be crunchy, so I have to be very careful when it comes to hairspray. So once it's like hardened some, I'll probably like brush it out a little bit. So yeah, that is it. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this. Give this a thumbs up if you did. Comment down below if you have any New Year's resolutions. 2019 is going to be a really exciting year and I'm so excited to get back to school and get back into the swing of things, establish a better routine and hopefully do better in school and not procrastinate because I'm like a semi-decent student but last semester I could not get into school. So hopefully this semester I will be able to get back into things and have a good mindset and a clear head and be able to do better than what I normally do. So anyways, thank you for watching. Have a good day. I'll see you in my next video. Oh, oh my god, it didn't even stop. I just realized I did not put on my lip gloss lipstick of the day. So I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Super Stay 24 Hour Color and this is in the shade Timeless Toffee 150. So, so now that I put that on my lips, you use the other side and it's just like a like clear like chapstick almost, but it just makes it stay, I guess. And I'm all done. This is my finished makeup look. I like pink, warm, orangey tones. So I don't even know if this is right. I don't even know what I'm talking about when I do my makeup. But anyways, I already said goodbye. So.